Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I am back with yet another movie review. This is for Shazam 2 Fury of the Gods. Um, before we get into it, if you are new to the channel, hit that like and subscribe if you want. If you're a returning viewer, thanks for coming back and checking out another video. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna get right into it. Uh, overall, I thought this movie, I thought this movie was good. I wouldn't say it was great. Um, I, it was very similar to the first one. It was very family, like, friendly movie. There was, it was a little bit darker, but, you know, not much. Um, I thought that the villains in this movie did a really good job. Lucy Liu, Helen Mirren, and I uh, see the girl's name, Rachel Zegler. I've never seen her in, in anything else, so I'm not familiar with her. Um, I thought Lucy Liu, especially, she did a really good job of, of like, being the villain. I thought she did a good job. Um, being evil, um, Zachary Levi as Shazam again, very, he did a good, pretty good job of, of playing Shazam um, some funny moments uh, overall the casting I think was, was pretty good you know the family of the characters that they had playing um, the Shazam heroes I guess you want to I'm not going to see each one of their names but as a group I think they, they did a good job playing off each other um Overall, I thought there was certain parts of the movie that were like, there was moments where Shazam, he can be almost, I don't know what the word is, but he, it's like almost like, like wanting to step it up, but you have to remind yourself like, okay, he's, he is still just a kid. And he's, you know, he's on, obviously not an adult. He's on, you know, doesn't have, you know, the maturity yet to deal with certain situations, maybe the way an older person would. Uh, so I, I think that, that part, I did kind of remind myself, I was always watching the movie, because there's parts where you want him to kind of, Get his, get his act together but you have to remember he's just a kid and obviously this is, kind of goes with you know being young so I say there's certain parts of the movie that I liked a lot like um, the fact that they're a lair um, I think there were certain parts of it that they showed more in this movie than compared to the first one um, things I don't want to give too much away but th there was certain parts that I liked that they were things that they figured out the team figured out about to let certain aspect that, that helped them during the movie that they didn't show in the first movie. I thought that was, that was really well done. I thought that was really cool. Um, again, I really can't say because I don't want to give it away. But overall, I, I thought the action sequences, you know, the fighting was, was, was pretty good. I think there's certain parts I think a little over the top. Um, the dragon scenes were, 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 were well done. Overall, I thought the the movie it went by pretty quick. It didn't. There was no slow parts. It didn't seem to like drag on at any any points. So even like when they involved his regular family, that didn't seem to slow things down. I mean, they, they weren't in a, a large portion of the movie, but the parts they were in, I thought it was it was pretty good. Uh, overall, I just thought the movie was, was good. I didn't think it was great or anything. Uh, I, I would give this like a one to ten. I probably maybe maybe a seven. Uh, out of 10, it was just okay. I mean, I don't think I would re go back to the movie and see it again. I will say that there is two extra scenes. There's a mid credit scene and an end credit scene. Uh, I don't want to give away w either one, uh, but I will say, I don't know if they're going to have any bearing on future movies, if they just didn't want to cut them out because it would cost money to, to re-edit the movie, to remove them with James Gunn taking over. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen. Obviously, I don't think anybody does. So I don't know if they do, have a bang on the future. I think it'll be pretty cool, but I have no idea. I know he's, he, James Gunn, had said that Shazam was part of the DC universe, so I don't know if that means it, it's going to be going forward, he will be, or if this is it. I have no idea. Um, so we'll have to wait and see as far as those two scenes uh, going forward, if they're going to mean anything. Uh, but I don't know, I guess we'll, we'll have to wait and see. Um, I think with that being said, I'm going to wrap this one up. Like I said, as we, I, I thought this gift was maybe a 6 or 7 out of 10. It was good, just not not great or fantastic. Just it's like very similar on par with the first Shazam. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap up this video. As always, appreciate you guys tuning to check out our videos. So hit that like and subscribe. Until next time.